During World War II, the United States Army Air Forces USAAF established numerous airfields in Utah for training pilots and aircrews of USAAF fighters and bombers. Most of these airfields were under the command of 2nd Air Force or the Army Air Forces Training Command AAFTC, a predecessor of the current-day United States Air Force Air Education and Training Command. However the other USAAF Support Commands Air Technical Service Command ATSC, Air Transport Command ATC, or Troop Carrier Command commanded a significant number of airfields in a support roles. It is still possible to find remnants of these wartime airfields. Many were converted into municipal airports, some were returned to agriculture and several were retained as United States Air Force installations and were frontline bases during the Cold War. Hundreds of the temporary buildings that were used survive today, and are being used for other purposes. Topic. Major airfields. Proving Ground Command Dugway Army Air Field, Toolnow, Michael Army Airfield Part of, Dugway Proving Ground, United States Army Air Technical Service Command Hill Field, Clearfield Ogden Air Depot, 12 January 1939 to 3 January 1955 482nd Base Headquarters and Air Base Squadron, the 2nd of January 1943 to the 1st of April 1944. 4135th Army Air Force Base Unit, the 1st of April 1944 to the 28th of August 1948. Now Hill Air Force Base and Ogden Air Logistics Center. Hinkley Field, Ogden Sub-base of Hill AAF Now, Ogden Hinkley Airport IATA, OGD, ICAO, KOGD, FAA LID, OGD Army Air Forces Training Command Kearns Army Air Base Army Air Forces Replacement Training Center, Army Air Forces Basic Training Center No. 5, 1 May 1942 – 30 September 1943 Army Air Forces Overseas Replacement Depot, 20 July 1942 – 30 April 1944 Assigned to 2nd Air Force, 1 October 1943 363rd Base Headquarters and Air Base Squadron, 1 October 1943 – 24 March 1944 Operational Airfield of Kearns Army Air Base AAFTC now, South Valley Regional Airport IATA, U-42 Salt Lake City AAB, APT, Salt Lake City Joint Use USAAF, Civil Airport as Freight Terminal Now, Salt Lake City International Airport and Salt Lake City Air National Guard Base Wendover Field, Wendover, Utah was Wendover Air Force Base 1947 to 1965. Now Wendover Airport IATA ENV ICAO KENV FAA LID ENV Auxiliary Fields, Della AF Ox 40 degrees 45 minutes 45 seconds north 112 degrees 47 minutes 14 seconds west, Knowles CAA 40 degrees 44 07 and 113 degrees 13 minutes 50 seconds west, low flight strip. Note, Della was reported to have had an asterisk. Type layout, runways under 2000 in length. Ox to Wendover AAF and to Salt Lake City AAB. 
later taken over by a private person and some remains can be seen. Two of the runways were paved by the new owner and can be seen still. It has been reported that occasionally aircraft have been seen there, assume private and uncharted and unlisted. No other data on this field exists. Status assumed closed. Note, Knowles was a 3000 by 3000 all-way field, clay, used by Wendover as an ox for light aircraft EGL-4. Some indications that a few P-47 ops took place as well.